Hello friends, in this video we will make the compound tetrabutyl ammonium hexamolybdate. You will need 2.5 grams of sodium molybdate, 3 milliliters of 36% hydrochloric acid and 1.2 grams of tetrabutyl ammonium bromide. Place a 100 milliliter Erlenmeyer flask on a stirrer with the magnetic stirring bar inside. Now, 2.5 grams of sodium molybdate was transferred using a powder funnel. Sodium molybdate was made by the reaction of molybdic acid with sodium hydroxide. 10 milliliters of distilled water was added to dissolve the compound. Even with stirring, some cloudiness persists. Now, add 3 milliliters of the 36% hydrochloric acid and immediately you will see everything getting cleared up. Now we make a solution containing 1.2 grams of tetrabutyl ammonium bromide in 2 milliliters of distilled water. The compound is extremely soluble in water and the resultant solution is colorless and clear. Now with constant stirring, the tetrabutyl ammonium bromide solution was added to the acidified sodium molybdate solution. Immediately you see the formation of a white precipitate and that is tetrabutyl ammonium octamolybdate. Now we place the flask in a water bath at 80 degrees Celsius for about 45 minutes. This is the overall reaction that is taking place. You can clearly see the transition of color from white to yellow. After 45 minutes, Filtration was carried out. I used a Buchner funnel for vacuum filtration, but a simple gravity filtration is sufficient here. Next, we wash the crude product a couple of times with cold distilled water to remove as much as of the side products. The recrystallization was then carried out from acetone, and the crystals formed are bright yellow in color with a needle shaped geometry. After removing the residual liquid, here are the crystals. You can clearly make out the needle shaped pattern of the crystals. Those crystals were then vacuum filtered and then the vacuum was turned on to dry the product. And here is the dry product. We obtained 1.67 grams of the recrystallized tetrabutyl ammonium hexamolybdate. So that's all in this video. I hope you have all loved this video. These are my Patreon supporters who are financially supporting me so that I am able to purchase new chemicals and equipments required for doing new videos. You can also support me via Patreon or PayPal. The links of both of them are in the description. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the bell button for notifications. Thank you.